and survival right with strength training okay so this is something I, this is the question i asked you back in maryland as well that if you take all comers in the population and you make them exercise you know what do you see so the data are as follows there's one study take 30000 adults you make them exercise twice a week this is only us sort of physical activity guideline recommendations this is not mm-hmm. this is not strenuous exercise this is 150 minutes a week or so but these patients were actually followed for 15 years, which is what makes this interesting. So you're actually following the same cohort That's, of this people. This is a pretty good longitudinal yeah. study. What study is this? So I'll, I'll give you the data. It's oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. But what you see in this case is a 46% reduction in all-cause mortality. Take a bunch of adults who've never trained before. You make them exercise. This is strength training. Mm-hmm. 15 years, half of them that should have been dead are still alive. Are still alive. Okay. Well, no, this is pretty solid. You, you, and, really and, this, solid and this has been studied in multiple evidence. environments. So there's a there's another meta analysis. Eleven randomized controlled studies. Three hundred thousand patients followed over nine years. Twenty percent decrease only strength training. Twenty percent mm-hmm. decrease in all cause mortality at nine years. Mm-hmm. Now, if you add, and God knows what they mean by strength well, training. Well, that's a whole other. Well, right, let's get, another that, that's consideration. Other, that's a whole other thing. Right. But now you add some aerobic exercise to that. Forty mm-hmm. percent decrease. Mm-hmm. Okay. You study men separately, you see the same thing. You see women separately, you see the same thing. Now, the thing that surprises me is how few people actually strength train. And this is a very right. broad definition of strength training. Right. Br- very broad. Very. So we'll talk about and that. As evidenced by the fact that the addition of aerobic conditioning right. to right. it actually improves the mortality. Correct. Or the, Correct. Because you and I both know that yeah. that. We're, we're talking correctly, single, right. single joint, you know, yeah, machines. Standard, you know, machines, gold lots gym of curls, right, of all that right. stuff, right? So. Uh, this is the Journal of the American Heart Association in 2017 looked at only women, mm-hmm. okay? And 21% of women had uh, admitted to doing any type of strength training in their lives. 20%, only 20%. Mm-hmm. Only 10% of women said they actually strength trained more than one hour per week. Mm-hmm. When you looked at that cohort that was training for less for one hour a week, again, 20% increase in long-term survival. See, it's just... So the question, the, the question to me is, and you know what? what's amazing about this, uh, Bill, is that this is so intuitively obvious to obvious. anyone obvious. that has considered this for more than a couple of minutes. Let, let me tell you one you other fascinating. Let me tell you one fascinating study. Okay, this is out in New Zealand, and this goes to the point about physical therapy in general. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> they took any elderly, frail woman who came into their hospital system with a hip fracture. Okay, they operated on her for the hip fracture. And mm-hmm. then took her and did formal strength training. So we're talking barbell strength training. The little 80-year-old grandmas. Mm-hmm. Guess what they found? An 80% reduction in mortality. I mean, this, just, is, this, this is, is, is astonishing <laughs> stuff. Right. And you look across the spectrum, Rip. You look at cancer. Mm-hmm. Cancer. You look at diabetes. You look at high blood pressure. You look at cholesterol. You look at patients with kidney disease. You look at orthopedic patients. You look at patients with mental illness. Mm-hmm. You know, schizophrenics. Strength training improves survival and quality of life across the board in everyone you look at. Yes. Yes. And which by the way, know, and that's I, why I love this t shirt. Yeah, it true. is in fact true. It is it true. Is in fact it is true. a truism. It 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 really is a truism. It's a truism. <coughs> it's a biological strength fact. is life. It's a biological strength fact. is life. Yes. And everyone that's paid attention, anybody that's been on a farm, anybody that's had dogs and cats, anybody that has had brothers and sisters, anybody that has an old relative in the family knows that physical strength is associated with a long life and more yes. importantly, a productive life. Rip, my it dad just, is 84 years old. He squats. Wow. Day. 